So the mushroom industry generates about 0.3% of the total plastic waste in the entire world. And oyster mushrooms alone generate 40,000 tons of plastic waste per year. And we don't need plastic to actually grow these mushrooms or any mushroom for that case. Because when you go out to the woods, you see these trees, you see mushrooms growing on logs out of the soil mycorrhizally with trees. You don't see plastic. You don't actually need plastic to grow mushrooms. It's created this convenience where we have plastic agar plates and syringes and all these grow bags where you can mass produce mushrooms in a warehouse or in a grow tent or just in your basement. And basically we've created an industry reliant on big oil. And we don't actually need plastic to grow mushrooms. You need plastic to grow mushrooms the way that most people are growing mushrooms. But if everyone's doing something, it doesn't mean it's right. It just means it's normal and it's the standard. But I'm here to say that that standard is wrong and we should transition to a plastic-free mycology and mushroom cultivation industry.